<clears throat> hey, it's Marina, the Trader Chick, and I've got something for you today. You know what attitude is? Well, let me tell you something. Your attitude is what's going to get you to be a winning trader. Have you ever thought about an attitude when you're trading? Have you ever even considered that your attitude is everything? So today, that's exactly what we'll be talking about attitude and your day trading. Are you ready to learn what could get you to that win with your attitude? I've got the secret for you to hear today. All right, guys, are you ready to get your attitude up? Because that is what's going to make the difference with your trading and your real trading, that attitude that you bring to the table. So let me give you a little bit of a hint here. Attitude is not innate. It is not something we are born with. It is something that we bring to the table because we have actually worked on our attitude. Okay, so if you're sitting here saying, well, I'm an introvert, I'm really shy, I don't care. You can work your attitude. And again, the cool thing about day trading is that it's just us and it's what we bring to the table. So attitude could certainly be like a confidence thing, right? It could be confidence. So today I want to talk about your attitude, right? It's how you are. You've got the attitude or you've got the negative, right? So you've got the positive attitude when you're strong and really, really looking forward to it and focusing. And you got the negative attitude, right? You could be negative, pessimistic. There's so many ways, right? So we're gonna be focusing on bringing that plus into the attitude, that A game into your attitude. And yes, you can have that attitude. So. It's confidence, baby, it's confidence. How do you have confidence? Own it, you own it. Have you ever seen some people that when they walk in the room, everybody just gravitates towards them or in whatever manner, right? Either I wanna to get to know that person, oh my God, that person's too cool, I don't know if I wanna really hang out, he might not, they might not wanna hang out with me. They've got attitude, they've got confidence, right? They walk in the room, They own the room. It doesn't matter if they know anybody in that room, right? It's in how they come in to the room. So you could also do that with your charts, right? You could come in being, oh, I don't know what's going to happen. I'm so scared. Or I'm ready to rock these charts. I have done my homework. I have done my due diligence. I have done my back testing. I have a strategy. I'm here. I'm owning these charts today and you stick with it and that is confidence and of course confidence just doesn't happen you do have to build your confidence and what is that and this is a given guys i'm hoping that you guys already are doing this and i don't have to tell you the preliminaries and the rudimentary parts of trading is you have to have a plan a strategy <clears throat> you have to have a strong mental muscle I have all these videos for you guys so you can check them all out. I talk about these really, really in, de in depth, but quick for you to be able to apply all that mental stability, threshold for how to attain wins and losses. This is all part of trading and it's all on how you build your confidence and you build the ownership attitude. That is the absolute most important, right? And it goes through the studying. You have done the work. When you've done the work, you are now ready to show up. There's this saying by, um, I don't know if you ever read the book, if you guys have ever read it, it's called The Art of War. And the author specifically says that the warrior dies before the battlefield. So imagine yourself as a warrior. What does that mean? It means they have done all the work here. They have been practicing. They know exactly what they're doing. And by the time they get to the battlefield and imagine yourself as a warrior, do you want to get there as a little, oh, I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Or I'm ready for battle. What's the difference? That's the attitude. That's it. Oh, I am. Yeah, I'm kind of ready or ready. Why? Because you have done the work. This is that work. You have done the work. And when you get into that trade, you've got that attitude. You are just drinking and enjoying what is happening because you own it. You know that this is what's going to work. So you have to have that attitude, right? So what happens at the end of the day, though, when you have the bad attitude, you have done badly because you aren't prepared, you haven't done your homework, what happens to you? 
here's the reality. And a lot of people don't realize that what we bring to the charts and what the charts do to us during the day continues on through the rest of our day and life. What happens in front of the charts does not go away when you close those charts, right? What does that mean? So if you're sitting here with a bad attitude and you're losing in that, when the second you close those charts, you're going to be bringing that bad attitude to your family, to your kids, to your dog, to yourself. You're going to be treating yourself like crap. You're going to be treating them because you're angry, because you had a bad attitude, because you weren't prepared. Most definitely. You didn't have that confidence because you just jumped in. You didn't do your due diligence, which I'm going to talk a little bit about today right now. So this is also another thing that is really, really important. First of all, pro athletes, the real ones that we hear about, not the ones that are sitting on the sidelines, they've done that work. They have the attitude. That's why when you hear them talking, they are full of attitude and they are confident, right? And the main thing is also, they're going to have their losses. They have more losses than we do, believe it or not. Yet, we remember their wins. Why? Because they have a short memory. What does that mean? What does a short memory mean? It means they have their loss. They just let it rub off and they move on to make the next valid move. And what is that? That's from the attitude. That's from the confidence, right? So if you are constantly doing that and not uh, having your bad attitude, but having the confident attitude, and it's not being positive. I'm not saying that. It's about having the confident attitude, the ownership attitude. All right, so I fucked up on there. Okay, I realize that. But it's okay because I'm going to go on now to the next move because I know that I know what I'm doing. I am ready for this battle and I'm continuing looking for that next valid move. We have short. To have, we have to have short memories too. That's what traders do. We have to have the short memories to give ourselves that confidence, that ownership. And this way, even if we have some lost days, and you will have lost days, but they will be lost days because you've already done the work. And every trade setup that you will take should have between 20 to 10% of a loss range. That means the win, the trading setup should be between 80 to 90% wins. You know that, and today you still did all the right moves. You owned the charts. You had the good, you had the strong attitude. So when you shut down that chart, when you shut down your computer, guess what? You're bringing that ownership attitude to the rest of your day, and that is confidence. You will treat your family with that positive, strong attitude. You will have that confidence because you understand what you have done. It's all about the attitude. Remember, the warrior who wins has done the work, and when they enter that battlefield, they're standing upright. They're not all meek and scared. Which one are you? Are you going to own it, or are you going to let it own you? I'm Marina, the Trader Chick, and I've got lots of great videos for you guys, and I want to hear, how do you own the market? What are you doing to have that strong attitude, that confidence? Right below in the com in the comments, I want to know what you guys are doing. And I have lots of other videos for you guys, so make sure you subscribe to get more and more videos just like this.